So, it looks like we have another election, the second in two years, the third major vote if we include the referendum. As there's not much time till the vote, we thought we would compare the promises so far from each party. So here's what we found. The Conservatives are full steam ahead for leaving the EU. Plans include leaving the single market, putting an end to the freedom of movement and striking new trade deals. In order to support working families, Tories are pledging to cap energy bills and the party will also continue to push their plan for more grammar schools across the UK. On the subject of taxes, Theresa May is strangely quiet. Labour's really focused on the NHS. Reforms include an end to the 1% pay cap for NHS staff and scrapping tuition fees for nurses and midwives. With regard to schools, the party plan to extend free meals and are looking at capping class sizes to improve learning. To address inequalities, Labour want to increase the minimum wage to £10 and reverse Tory cuts to inheritance tax while also increasing corporate tax. With regards to Brexit, Labour will reject Theresa May's plan altogether, but they haven't yet said what their alternative is. To try to regain some of the trust they lost in 2010, the Lib Dems are proposing that graduates won't have to repay their student loans until they're earning a much higher salary than the level currently set. The party will also set up a new tax to fund the NHS and improve social care. The Lib Dems are dead set against a hard Brexit and they want a second referendum on the terms of the Brexit deal. The Green Party's top line is education, scrapping tuition fees, bringing back maintenance grants and maintaining research funding for universities. They are also hinting at lowering the voting age to 16. Like the Lib Dems, the Green Party will call for a second referendum to vote on the Brexit deal. They are opposed to any hard and fast Brexit. UKIP have announced they would enforce a ban on burqa. UKIP are also strongly against female genital mutilation. Plans include stricter laws against parents and medical checks for girls at risk. They also plan a 10 billion a year cut in the foreign aid budget. UKIP strongly backed Brexit last year and leader Paul Natal wants a swift Brexit.